My name is Pallavi Thagat and I am a professor in the Applied Magnetics Lab. I head the group that works on some of the biosensing medical applications for magnetic materials and devices. So one of the projects that we are working on is using very, very small magnetic particles. We call them nanoparticles because of the size of these particles and using them to detect the presence of disease markers and possibly detect tumors and treat them. So the reason for using magnetic particles is because they are inherently compatible with biological systems. There's nothing in our system biologically that would interfere with the magnetic signals that we would get from these particles. So we would be able to discern them very, very clearly. So we work with chemists and biologists. The chemists synthesize the nanoparticles and they give them to us. So we put them in a sample holder like this which we then insert in what is called a vibrating sample magnetometer to characterize the properties of the nanoparticles. So the biologists then tell us how to prepare the surface of these nanoparticles so that they will go very specifically and attach to the tumor that we want to treat. Once the particles have been synthesized and the surface has been prepared to go attach to the tumor. For example, you can see these particles would be injected into the mouse as shown in this image and where they are injected is highlighted in red. And then we will go with very fine control over magnetic field and select these nanoparticles over that region of the tumor and heat the particles to destroy the tumor cells without damaging the surrounding healthy tissue. What is very exciting about this field is that it brings together researchers from very many disciplines, the chemists, the biologists, the engineers, to solve problems in medicine, whether it is biosensing, detecting the presence of diseases early on, or whether it is treating these diseases and imaging tumors. And this is what we are all about. Mm -hmm.